welcome back for another episode of Let's Play Shovel Knight, the Spectre of Torment. I am the Decepticon Gamer, and who should we go to this time? I'm gonna say... Mole Knight, how about that? Let's go to the Lost City, how about that? Alright. Grab some stuff. Get all that money, buy all my upgrades. Since I haven't bought any of the other costumes yet. There's way too much bouncy gel in this level. Hopefully I can remember where all of the things are. Let's see, do I have... I do have that one. Haha! -ha. The best thing for taking out those guys. By far. Ow. Oof. Gotta be careful with those, uh, those dash slashes sometimes. Oh and oh no, it's a it's a kitty. Stop kitty. Oh, I feel I feel bad about killing the kitty. Mostly because he <clears throat> he would have had more money for me. No, mm, you little slime, you slime, you. Yeah, at least I got a checkpoint. And the money shouldn't be that won't be hard to get to. There, die already. I've had enough of your sliminish. And Hello, Beetle Friend. It's been so long since we've been acquainted. You know what? Never mind, I don't need to kill you. Yeah. Sneak attack. Yeah, they're those uh slime covered little strike points are interesting. But you do a little sneak on this guy. Looks like those guys should have more than uh, four hits worth of or take more than four hits worth of damage. But oh well, I'm not really complaining. Just making an observation. Yeah. I knew he was coming. <laughs> City mole. Jigglyfish. Silly jigglyfish. Hiya. Yeah, you gotta be careful on that spot that you don't uh, end up sticking to the wall. I've done that before. Plenty of times, in fact. Hmm. 
my first few times through this level, not not great. I definitely had some problems. I always love how like the game the game conditions you to come out of a problem from a certain direction. Like there, you, you you really, really want to jump. But if you jump, you're going to die. <laughs> so it's, you know, I, I like that. I like that it's, it's designed that way where uh, what am I trying to say here? Um, Where you know there's an expectation that, like, oh well, yeah, I, I know how I know how to solve this problem, and then if you do, you're just spelling your own doom at that point. Oh, I missed. Yeah, I don't know why the timing just seems a little not super tricky, but at the same time. It, uh, it just seems weird. It's like, it's not quite, like, right when it's underneath. <gasps> Ooh. That slime, the slime's almost got me again. That claw is just so useful. It's one of my favorite curios. Yeah, here's here's a very sneaky one. Oh, no, I want to jump on the thing. Yeah, you want to be very careful. It's, you want to. It's again. It's this is one of those uh, situations where you know you you want to jump, and to start off with, you absolutely cannot. That oh, so many, so many birdies, so many crazy birdies. I want, oh, wait, that's not what I wanted. Ooh. Did I get all the things? I think I, yes, I, I did. Cool. I forgot to check and see how many how many I had going into this level. Hello, Mole Knight. Break time is over. Are you in the right place, ready to continue the dig? Very much so. In fact, I'm here with a business proposal. The Enchantress has need of excavators and wishes to employ the best. What? Who? Well... I, you found the best. The best at digging. My claws are sharp. My technique is flawless. Excellent. Then you only need... But I'm absolutely not looking for new work, and break time is over! Ow. Eh. I'll get a couple slashes in. There you are. Ow. Damn it. Got stuck over there. Ow. There we go. I, I do like how they change up the each of the order of no quarter fights. Because most of them, if you if you just if they were the, exactly the same, they wouldn't really be that much of a challenge. I feel 
because most of the time you'd be able to breeze through them so easily. What curio do we have this time? Ah, oh, the Kronos coin. Oops, that was not right. Oi! Ow, goddammit. That was too slow. Yeah. Ooh, that was close. Almost bumps, bumped myself right back into the lava. And blah blah blah, yep. Okay, let's go get... Let's do some upgrades. Um, that Kronos coin, very a very handy... Oh, I should probably go talk to the... Ma, our a new recruit. Are they bringing my bread out? I asked for bread. Everything up here takes forever. Could you ask? Go ask about the bread. He's very insistent about his bread. Doop a doop a doop a doo. All right, what do we got this time? That's one. I, I don't know. I there's there's certain points when that one can come in handy. But, I don't know, I feel like I don't use that one very often. But, uh, with, especially with the upgraded version of the Kronos coin, uh, that's probably one of the uh, most useful if you're trying to go for uh, the untouched achieve or the, yeah, the achievement or the feat. Behold my metallic sheen! Maybe I should combine everything I've learned and serve the Clockwork Tower. I've always found machines to be fascinating, and Tinker Knight seems like a level-headed leader. Yeah! Anyway, uh, we have 1,400. I think that's probably a good, good a place as any to call this episode. So thank you so much for watching this installment of Let's Play Shovel Knight Spectre of Torment. I have been the Decepticon Gamer, and next time we shall go and probably go to maybe, maybe uh, Treasure Knight? Maybe Tinker Knight? Poor, poor Knight, maybe? Hard to say. We will decide next time. So, see you then. Bye!